operate tours every single day for whale watching and for sport fishing. So this type of catastrophe in our local area is just devastating for business. Um, and on top of that, the wildlife as well. I mean, we were sad about, you know, missing out potentially on the beach, but I was more concerned about the animals. And I know there's a big wildlife preserve over there. So. And as uh, most of the countries in the world now have committed to getting to net zero emissions by greenhouse gas emissions by 2050, that doesn't mean you can continue to emit just as much as you've been emitting until 2049 and then turn it off. It doesn't work that way. You have to begin that transition now. I'm really hopeful that that can be a wake up call to our decision makers and to everyone that we need to move as fast as we can away from dependence on oil and gas um, toward a clean energy future.